as people go through life, their ideologies will change. Some will go through one change and that'll be it. And some people will go through multiple changes in their ideologies before they find an ideology they are most comfortable with. For most people, their changes of ideologies come from a sense of, well, just observing the real world and coming to their own conclusions on what they must believe in. But for some people, they change their ideologies not so much because of a, a change of heart or a change of mind, but more so along the lines of, will this make me money? If I believe in, you know, this ideology, how much money am I going to get from idiots who will listen to every single word I have to say? Case in point, Aiden Paladin. Over the past couple of years, Aiden Paladin has been, uh, been going through some changes. Not just politically, but religiously as well. In the beginning, Aiden Paladin was born a Jew. Aiden Paladin was a Jew for a good long while. Until eventually, Aiden Paladin did a DNA test, where she discovered that one of her ancestors was raped by a Viking, and as a result of that, she is now related to Odin, king of fucking Asgard. And so, because Aiden Paladin's great-great-great-great-great-grandfather is a fictional fucking character, Aiden Paladin decides, fuck it, I'm gonna be a pagan now. Then, of course, as I'm sure you're all aware, recently Aiden Paladin decided in her infinite wisdom that uh, she's no longer a pagan, she's a Christian now. Because reasons. And money. She, she, she really wants that fucking money. But politically, it's the same goddamn thing, okay? Four years ago, when I first discovered who Aiden Paladin is, she was on a podcast. And Aiden Paladin stated that at, when she was a teenager, she was a fucking communist. Anarcho-communist, but it's still just the fucking same. Let's be real here. Yeah, she was a fucking anarcho-communist. She wanted to live in some big old utopia. But then eventually, you know, she decided she was going to be libertarian. Then conservative because Trump and memes and shit. And now she's all for monarchism. And then earlier today, Aiden Paladin has a complete and total mental fucking breakdown on Twitter. Where she says, fuck this shit, I'm just an anarchist now. Quite the, quite the fucking jump from, uh, you know, monarchism to anarchism in just the span of a week. A week, two weeks now. Yeah. Uh, personally, I'm not buying this at all. I don't think it's so much of a grift anymore than, well, Aiden Paladin's just having a mental fucking breakdown. I... It would be interesting to see what political ideology Aiden Paladin picks next. Maybe she'll come out as a feminist and she's seen the light then. I don't know. Maybe she'll be a black supremacist. <laughs> that would be interesting to see. Very interesting indeed. Or hell, maybe she'll come out as trans. I don't know. The possibilities are endless with this woman. Anyway... Uh, as is always the case, a link to the Aiden tweet where she's having a mental breakdown proclaiming to the world that she's an anarchist now will be in the description below. So, um, yeah. That's, uh, that's something. Anyway, catch you guys whenever.